everybody and welcome to another episode of my 100 baby challenge in the sims 4. so today we are back i wasn't able to record on my normal recording day because the game was broken <laughs> but we're back today and i hope i don't have any cookie in my teeth let me just have a drink oh i just want to i was just hoping that uh it would clean my teeth out a little bit i know that sounds disgusting maybe i'll have some water i'll have some water yes i'll grab my massive thing of water and i'll drink some water and hopefully that will clean my teeth out Ugh, oh, it's flat. It's not fizzy anymore. Yucky. But anyway, let's get on with the gameplay, shall we? So it is 6 a.m. on a Saturday morning. We should actually be really, really close to giving birth. So what's this? Nothing tying me down from single and loving it lifestyle. Yes, queen. Yes. Okay. Wait, so what's happening? What did I write down for today? Oh, yes. So eventually I do actually want to be able to make some ambrosia to bring our ghost boy back because we love him with all of our heart. So you guys might actually have to help me out with that. Help me to figure out how to create ambrosia because I literally have no idea how to do that. So we just have to make sure that he knows that we love him. So let's go ahead and beguile our ghostly lover. So our H baby is going to be born today. And the last name is Rossi because the baby's father is David Rossi from Criminal Minds. Oh, and I've decided what the next theme of baby names is going to be. So it's going to be gemstones and crystals. So cannot wait to get on with the next theme name. For now, we're still doing space names. So our H space name is going to obviously be the baby inside her belly. And then after that, we still need I baby names. So baby names that, uh, that have to do with space, but also start with the letter I. And then that should be five children with so we have eris was one faye was two galileo was three the baby in here hopefully it's just one baby that'll be four and then the next baby will be five if she does have twins that means that will be all five and then we can go onto gemstones starting with i but we'll have to just uh wait and see what's going to happen from there so let's just have a look at what's going on with these kidlings okay so you're actually very hungry and you're very stinky as well so we have a little baby stinky minky let's pull out some roast chicken and you can go ahead and eat the chicken the chimkin go ahead and eat the chimkin my lovey cool beans excuse me you like video games sure you can like video games if you want to my love so you go ahead and eat that and then after that mumsy is going to have to actually feed you who has died now cassandra sprague i actually have no idea who that is so oh my goodness uriah that's one of her older brothers oh so cute so cute he's uh he's just become an elder she's literally about to pop so i actually do not remember what time she was supposed to have the baby so that's you know that's uh cool beans but also we should go in here and oh wow we can totally woohoo with zane actually let's do that let's make sure that we keep their love connection as strong as we possibly can and then after that we will actually need to go ahead and give galileo a, a bubble bath Oh, cool. So they're going to go upstairs. That is great. That is perfect. Oh my goodness. Actually, don't even worry about it because Eris has decided to step up and be a grade A big brother and he's going to give a little Galileo a bath. What is with this nasty, dirty brown water though? I honestly do not understand. It is so gross. And also, Eris, you are the bestest little boy that I've ever met for doing that for your little brother. So, Faye. What are we doing here? We need to work on skills. So obviously no one's going to be going to school today. So we do actually have the whole weekend in order to get their skills up. So what are you anyway? You're a social butterfly. Okie dokie. So look, there's no way you're going to be able to meet five sims. So you're not going to be able to... Blah, 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 blah. You're not going to be able to work on your uh, aspiration anyway. So let's have a look-see at some other kind of things for you to do. So we can actually come down here. And we'll go ahead and we'll chat in the kids' chat room and that should get your social up a little bit and then that should ho hopefully help with getting your skill up to level two. And what are you doing, Eris, my lovey? You need to get a skill up to level three. So what do you have so far? You've just got parenting. All right then. All righty then. Let's have you work on something different. Let's have you... Uh, let's have you assist with this random random project here. Zane is in this little tub here right now. Love that for him. I'm also totally thinking that I want to renovate the house with the new stuff from the cottage living pack but at the same time I really love the pinks and mint 
pastels in the house so I don't know it would have been really cool if there had have been some bunk beds that came with the cottage living stuff but obviously there wasn't so you know did we do the woohoos I'm not even sure <gasps> from mediocre shower woohooing oh my goodness I'm so sorry you're too sad okay how about we come over here and share our people person tips with a ghost that kind of seems like really rude but okay because I want to keep her relationship up with this little man's because we do want to eventually marry him if we're able to as long as we don't forget about him uh you know uh, we, we, blah, 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 blah. we should be fine you know we should be fine Galileo what are you doing sweetheart okay you are doing just fine, my love. But what I'd like you to do is go and play some makeup a live in the little tingy. And that should... Oh, no, your imagination's already perfection. Okay, we don't even have to worry about that. Just click, 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 click away. What just happened? I do not know what just happened. What happened? Excuse me? Hello? Did somebody die? I hope not. That was weird. Okay, so come over here, my lovey. And you're going to go and get some skills up in other ways, okay? That's what you're gonna do, my little love bug. That's what you're gonna do. Oh, yes, indeedy. And then we can also have somebody help you out with your potty. Eris is taking care of some traits of his own. Uh, Venus is flirting with her ghost boyfriend. No, let's not invite him to fill the baby. Ho, my lanta. What was your last name again? Guthrie. <gasps> Wait, was your child Xena? Wait, let me see. I need to see now. Was it Xena? Was it Xena Guthrie? Yeah, okay, so Xena is actually the ghost boy's daughter. So, love that. Okay, so you're actually hungry. How cool would it be, though, if we moved this entire family onto a farming lot and we did the simple living lot trade and then they literally would have to obviously uh, grow their own food and everything like that in order to actually, like, live. I think that would be... It would just add such like a more unique element of like hardness of like hard you know what I mean challenge it would just add so much more of a challenge and it would just be so much more fun but I don't know let me know what you guys think because I can't imagine that I'm the only person that has had that thought and I don't want everybody's 100 baby challenge to end up the same I guess we shall see what happens eventually so Faye my love okay you could actually do with some food as well so let's wait for Eris to grab some food or not okay uh, let's go ahead and order some food. Wait, did you get your skill up? Oh, you did. Okay, stop socializing in the kids' chat room then. Go ahead and grab some food or don't. Okay, cool beans. Go ahead and grab some food now. Okay, perfection. And then you can go upstairs and use one of these toilets. Go ahead and do that, my little lovey. Venus, who is... No, go away. Leave me alone. You could actually do with a little bit of toilet time. So let's take you to the potty real quick. And then we can go and potty train Galileo a little bit because that would be really, really good for him. So, cool, cool. All right, so his communication didn't quite get up, but his thinking's getting a little bit up, which is really good. Eris is taking care of himself and he actually got his painting skill up. So what if we actually found an easel and just had him continue working on that? I think that would be a good idea. Do we not have an easel? Excuse me? Literally, do we not have an easel on this lot? That is so stupid. I mean, we have this like skill building room with no easel. Are you kidding? Are you actually kidding me? What the heck? All right, so we're gonna have to go ahead and grab ourselves an easel. Very, very interesting that we do not have one. Do we have something in here? Excuse me, we're not in free build mode. Oh no, oh no. I don't know what is going on. That might actually be a mod that I put in my game. Yeah, that's actually not a good thing. Okay, let's go ahead and grab this university one just because why the heck not? Uh, yeah. So I'm going to have to go and remove that always free build mod because I didn't know that that would affect home lots. So that's cool. But anyway, let's go out here and let's do a playful painting because why the freak not? Let's just go ahead and do that because then that is his... Uh, we can just work on that skill for him and that should be a lovely love love lovely jubbly okay the finchwick fair has started come win amazing prizes by competing in competitions the thing is though we don't have a llama or wool so we can't do anything like that soz but uh yeah nah uh -huh. i would like to but we just can't we just don't have the 
means to do so. At least not right now anyways. <laughs> okay, so you are going to continuously potty train Galileo until he's level three. And Eris, how, were you able to get your painting skill up? No, you weren't. Wow, okay, so could you please actually resume that? I don't know why you stopped, so okay. You wanna level up in your painting skill, cool beans. You actually wanna be an archeology span scholar, but the thing is I'm not gonna do that for you because this is not a, uh, uh, what was that, Jungle Adventures? This is not a Jungle Adventures Let's Play, sorry, but actually I am thinking about doing a mini Jungle Adventures series. So if you would be interested in that, please let me know because I really do actually want to get that underway eventually. Okay, so Galileo, my little lover, you are not going to do that. Oh, sweet, he just got level two of the potty skill. We love, we love, we love. Romance festival is in town, but guess what? We do not give a damn. Okay, so you're doing that, but what I want you to do is go get leftovers because that would be really, really great. And you're going to cook together with Faye, excuse me? Clover pancakes, no, thank you. What's happening? Is my game broken? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I am saving all oh, my lanta. That was goddamn terrifying. Holy moly, who died? Quinn, oh sweetie. So that was obviously one of Venus's older siblings uh, as well. So that's cool. So Quinn has now passed away, which means Q-R-S-T-U-V. Oh wow, okay. Not many children of Stella's left to go. I actually thought that that was Stella, but it's Caitlin, love that. So we still have Riley who's alive. We have Quartz who is probably just about to die right now because that would be Quinn's twin sister. And then we have Uriah and Scarlet and we have Tate. Okay, so all of our siblings pretty soon are going to be dead. And uh, I, oh wait, and we also have our twin sister Violet, of course. So, you know, that's uh, always cool. And I wish they'd fix this bug with uh, toddlers not having phones, but their phones always ringing when somebody kicks the bucket. I don't really know what's going on today. <laughs> I actually, I wrote down stuff for this episode to like get stuff done. Okay, is that, uh, is that Quartz? Did Quartz pass away now as well? Yep, I knew it, I knew it. But I think I've already mentioned everything that we were gonna write down today, so I don't know. I guess we're just kind of uh, winging it at this point. So anyway, okay, Venus, my lovey, what are we doing? Oh yeah, that's right, that's cool. So she's gonna eat, and then after she eats, I'm actually gonna have her go to the toilet really quick. And she's actually really, really tired, but I'm fairly certain she's, who on earth has died now? Excuse me? Riley, are you kidding? Okay, you kids literally didn't even know any of your aunties or uncles. So like, can you just get over yourselves? Because you're really irritating me, quite honestly. So everybody's gonna be super, super, super sad now for like days on end, but like, it's fine. We can just, uh, it's fine. It's absolutely fine. Could we actually get your social up a little more so that you don't have to worry about getting it up again uh, once you get your B grade? Because that would be really, really great if you could do that. And Eris, my love, how about you assist with this project as well? We'll actually get rid of these projects. Sweetie, sweetie, sweetie. You can assist with that project. There we go. Okay, cool beans. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Literally, Venus, you should be like popping right now. I just, I don't understand. I just don't understand. So could you actually repair that? Because it, that's really, really annoying. Cool, Eris just got the logic skill. That is lovely. Sweetie, literally repair that. I don't care if you're busting. You can go to the toilet after you've, oh my gosh. Okay, whatever, whatever. You know what? We've got the money. Let's just replace it. I don't even care. And you can just go straight to sleep. We don't have any infants at the moment, so we don't really have to worry about that too, too much. Eris is perfectly fine. He just needs to get a skill up to level three, which he still hasn't done. I don't know why he is not resuming his playful painting. Uh, does he have to be in a playful mood in order to do that? Because, uh, excuse me, what's going on? Okay. Okay, I don't know why the camera panned over to him. I would like you to get your social up to level four so that we don't have to worry about you there. Now you, my darling, oh my lanta, you could do with some food. Okay, so what we'll do is we'll open up this. We'll go to wherever you are. Sweetie, I know you're hungry and you know what? The food's right there. So just go ahead and grab a serving, okay? And shut your little trap, okay? Because we do not need to be worrying about little toddlers right this very, very minute. 
Holy moly. Okay, so you eat and then, okay, what we could do is we could have you just kind of work on some interactions with the snuggly woggly bears and hopefully we can just kind of, yeah, I don't know where I was going with that, but yeah. Okay, cool. So Faye, all right, that is actually going up very, very slowly, but that's okay. We'll put, ooh, blah, blah, blah. We shall pop you into bed fairly, fairly soon, my lovey. You can go ahead and take a shower and your fun and social is really low. So how about we pop some earbuds into your ear holes? Cottage core, excuse me? Excuse me? What? <laughs> okay, so that's obviously new. I didn't know that that was a thing. Cool beans. So you're chatting in the chat room. Okay, so you're actually quite tired now. Now, which bed did I give you? That's Eris's, that's Bluebell's. Faye, okay, sweetie, I gave you that bed. So you go there. So that means this is Eris's bed. Excuse me? Was that not your bed? Oh, are you already going to bed? Okay, that's fine. You go to bed, sweetheart. Why are your earbuds not still on? That's um, interesting. So yeah, usually easy listening is right there, but now apparently it's cottage core. So cool, love that for him. He can listen to music while he sleeps. So Venus is asleep, you're all good. You're about to go to sleep. Now, Galileo, you do need to go to sleep as well. So how about we just make sure that the butler goes to bed because we hate when the butler restricts us from being able to super speed throughout the night. And we shall be back in the morning and right after this quick commercial break. Y'all, it finally happened. She finally went into labor. Holy moly. Okay, so let's actually go to the hospital. And I don't actually have any comments for baby name suggestions on my last few videos, which makes me a little bit of a sad panda. I'm very sorry that I haven't been putting my content out regularly. That's probably my bad that I don't have any comments, but that's okay because I do have a name that I would like to use. So we're at the hospital now and apparently she needs to go to the toilet. So that's cool. So we'll have her go ahead and go to the toilet. I was expecting a different hospital for a second, but that must have been my, that was in my not so berry save that we actually got a new hospital. So that's absolutely fine. <laughs> I don't know why I was expecting a different hospital, but it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. So the name that I've decided to go with, whether it be a boy or a girl, because I don't care. I'm going to just decide that this is a unisex name is dun da da dun. Oh, it's a boy. Cool. So Hallie after Hallie's comment. Uh, oh my gosh. What was the last name? Rossi, Rossi, because David Rossi. Okay. One baby or oh, two. Okay. It was just one baby. Cool. Cool. So welcome Mr. Hallie Rossi into our fine little fan bands. Alrighty, so we are finally back home. Okie dokie. So let's go over to the little baby and let's just assume it's going to be super hungry because they usually are when you just get home from the hospital. So we're going to go and we're going to super efficient baby care for our baby. Our children should all be in bed. So I don't know why they're not. I don't know why the game decides to do that to me all the time, but let's just go ahead and go to sleep. Was this your bed, sweetheart? Yes, it was. You go to sleep and Galileo, my little sweetheart, you need to go to sleep as well. My little honey. Oh, amazing. Hallie just became good friends with Venus. We love to see it. Okay, so Venus is just going to have a quick little snack. And then uh, actually, Butler, could you please actually go to sleep? Like, are you actually kidding me? Where's the Butler options? Excuse me, Butler, assign a task, go to sleep, get out of my face. You go to the toilet, go to bed. And then we will be back in the morning. I totally just realized that we didn't get her pregnant. Oh my gosh. Okay, so <laughs> we actually right now need to decide who we're going to have another baby with. So let's go. So we've already had a baby with Derek, Aaron and David Rossi. We haven't had a child with Spencer Reed just yet. So we could invite him over and just go ahead and see if we can have a little bit of a baby with Mr. Spencer Reed. Hopefully it works because it would be really cool if that would work. And then after Spencer Reed, we could totally have a child with Booth, Sealy Booth from the TV show called Bones. I actually just finished watching every single last episode of that TV show and I'm so sad that it's actually over because it wasn't like finished and that makes me really, really sad. But let's go. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's ask for some advice. Sure, whatever. Let's see if we can do anything. We can't even beguile. Let's try to flirt with him. I don't know. Let's just see what we can and can't do, I guess. How are you speaking to him when you're outside and he's inside? All right, then. 
cool beans. So let's just go ahead and try our best here. We'll see what we can do. You're hungry, but I mean, let's just uh, move on. <laughs> let's brighten his day. Let's kind of zoom in a little bit here. Uh, oh no, no mischief. Let's just go to romance. Let's give him a gloomy compliment. See if we can get him a little, you know, a, a little in the bag. Just a little, just a little, little in the bag. Let's discuss some fitness techniques. Uh, I don't really want to teach to knit, but oh, uh, sing about new skill day. Sure thing, chuck and wang. We'll talk about some cooking. Why not? Oh, I just realized that she never cooked any food with the with uh with uh with uh with uh with uh with Faye. Oh, my lanta. What's going on? Oh, okay. Let's give him another gloomy compliment. I don't know. I, I would just like for her to get pregnant. Oh, she's actually in a better mood now. She's actually feeling happy. So let's beguile this sweet little boy. How about we go ahead and we do that? Ah, uh, go away. No one cares. Okay. So Mr. Spencer Reed is now beguiled. We love it. Love, love, love. We love to see it. So let's go ahead and embrace him. Let's just see if we can be, you know, a little bit romantic with this little man's. And then what we'll do is we'll take a photo with Spencer so that we can hopefully go ahead and add him to our baby daddy wall. Okie dokie. So let's see if we can actually get a good photo in here. And I can hear the baby crying, which is an issue. He actually kind of does look like Spence, doesn't he? He's kind of cute. We love to see it. Okay. So let's take as many photos as we can. And hopefully one of them is decent quality. So, uh, okay. All right, my love. Let's just run over here real quick and do a super efficient baby care. And then we will come back to Spence. Hold up a minute. Hold up a minute. I don't know what just happened, but okay. It was like he wanted to take a photo with us. That was very strange, but all right. Can we do anything yet? No, we cannot. Okay, that's fine. I mean, we haven't even given him a kiss yet, so we should probably try to work on that. Let's try to give him a bold pickup line. I love that she's feeling confident, even though all of her siblings are dropping dead. Okay, cool, cool. So he is feeling very, very flirty. That is lovely jubbly. Let's give him a little embrace and then blow him a kiss. Okay, dokey. And let's exchange numbers. Sure thing, chicken wing. And what else can we do? We'll compliment his appearance. I really do just want to be getting in there so that we can get a baby and then get out of there, you know? Oh, cool. First kiss. Oh, oh, it's first kiss time, my friends. Hello. Hi. Yes. Okay, cool. That was uh, a little bit delayed there. Did not like that. Oh, I forgot to get a screenshot of their first kiss. Oh, my goodness. Let's blow him a little kiss. He looks so cute in this little sweater vest. Oh, I love it. I love him. He's so cute. Yes, let's go and try for a baby. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Hopefully that works. And then we can ask him to just be friends because we don't want to lead anybody on. We just want your babies. Like, um, yeah. So if you could just like give us your specimen and then get going, that would be really, really great. No, Spencer, don't you dare. My lovey, you are not going anywhere. You're going to hang out with us. Please, Spencer, do not go anywhere. Spencer! Spencer, where are you going? Please say yes. 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 And then we can try for a baby. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hi ho. Hi ho. It's off to make a baby. We go. Once the game stops lagging and being a piece of there we go, there we go. Okay, so let's just give them their privacy. Their privacy, oh, actually they're coming upstairs. So, um, yeah, okay, so that didn't work. Uh, okay, I don't know what the hell just happened, but cool. Let's just get him back over here because I don't know why he left. Hang on, focus the camera. Where did he go? Oh, he didn't go anywhere. What on earth? Oh my goodness, Faye. My lovey, we actually, uh, mummy needs the, the bathroom. So if you could just like go sit over here, that would be really great. And, uh, yeah. So, oh, excuse me. What's going on? What on earth is going on? Spencer, 
Spencer, you are not going anywhere, my love. What the hell? Okay. Okay. It's fine. Just go. Just leave. And we will go to your house. This man's is playing hard to get. Uh, he also just really loves hanging out with his crew. So why are we too sad now? Oh, my lanta. Why, why, why? Okay. So let's just uh, try to get that out of the way because that would be really great if we could just you know, not be in a bad mood. Wait, why are we talking with David Rossi? We're supposed to be talking with Spencer Reed, excuse me. Let's brighten your day, my lovey. And let's become best friends. Sure. I mean, we just met you, but let's become best friends, okay? And okay, now she's feeling absolutely fan fantastic. So let's go ahead and try for a baby with Spence in the bush. Okay, so they're finally doing that, which is just great. And Derek looks hella sad. Oop, sorry about that. And uh, David looks uh, a little bit uh, dazed. So that's cool. I uh, don't know what's uh, wrong with you, but okay. All right, so they're done. Now I'm going to check if she's pregnant. And she is. So that's amazing. Now she's going to go and get herself some food. So that is really, really cool. So how about we have you skill build on painting? Yes, please. Skill build on social and you, oh, you can't do anything. Cool. Well, let's just hope that you're being taken care of by your older siblings because otherwise that's just uh, sad. Okay, so there's a really, really, really cute little cat here. Oh, it's like a little fluffy cat. Hi, honey. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh I wish I could take you home, sweetheart. I know, honey. Oh, my honey bunny, my little baby. And it's a stray as well. Oh, my goodness. Wait, why are you running? What is wrong? What is wrong with you? Is that the doctor? I feel like maybe that's the doctor and maybe she's running away from Venus because maybe she's like, oh, no, it's that crazy lady that comes in every nine months to give birth to another child. Oh, excuse me. Hello. Hi. Why did you just punch us? Okay. Oh, we should probably ask him to just be friends as well because... We don't want him thinking that we're like in love with him or anything like that. Revolting bush from Dirty Bush. Oh my gosh, that's disgusting. That is so disgusting. Wow. Okay, so they have cooled off their romantic relationship, which is perfectly fine. Also, once she is finished grilling, she does need to use the bathroom. So, or not. Okay. So she's going to use the bathroom now. <laughs> and then she's going to resume the hot dogs. And we should probably bring these hot dogs home with us because otherwise that's just a little bit of a waste. So what's going on here? Okay, so we're deeply connected with Spence. That's just great. Okay, so they're on the thing now, but you're gonna grab a serving. Come on, darling, grab a serving. Very good. Now, because these are actually yours, you're going to, excuse me, are you serious? You can't, you, you can't, oh, there we go. Put into inventory. So Aaron Hotchner has come over to eat some of Venus's hot dogs as well. This cat is screaming. Holy moly. Also, why is this blue? Why are you blue? Okay, so you've actually expired. Cool beans. So you're going to be relisted. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go back home. Alrighty, so we are now back home. And we should probably put our food away. Let's be real. What is this? Sausage and peppers spoiled. Disgusting. Go ahead and pop that away. Now, okay, yes, yeah, so we should probably put Spence on the wall. So here's Mr. Rossi down there. So let's just go ahead and find the best one. So seven, four, five, four, six, four, seven, four, and six, four. So we can go for this one or we can go for this one. I guess we'll just go for the first one. Cool. And then we shall, oopsie doopsie, add a frame, a white frame, and now you are baby daddy number 34. So 35. Where's the rename section? Number 35, Spencer Reed. How do you spell Reed? I think it's like that. Let me just check. E-I-D, E-I-D. Okay, so I did spell it correctly. Yay. Alrighty, so that is absolutely fan flippantastic. So that's that. Now we can actually get rid of those. So cool beans. Oh, now that I'm seeing all of these dyes in her inventory, I'm wondering if we should actually have her go ahead and make a damn candle. Go and make a shale dipped candle. 
Now, Eris, my sweetie, what are you doing? You still need to get your painting skill up. Alrighty. So let's have you go ahead and resume that playful painting. I don't know if you'll be able to because you're not actually te technically playful right now, but we can try. Okay, so it does. Okay, that's so good. Wow. Okay, so he's just he's just gotten his skill up to level three. That's so good. So he should actually be able to get an A grade tomorrow at school. And then you, my lovey, you might be able to get a B grade. Who knows? Who knows? What are you doing, sweetheart? You're going to go do a close shot. Cool, cool. Uh, okay, the butler's just coming back in the house. That's interesting. Now, what are you doing, my lovey? Okay, so we could, with you, my little love, we could have you go ahead and do some what's that interactions with the little bear over here. And, Mumsy, you can, after you're finished with your candle, come over here and super efficient baby care for your little babbly roo. But actually, you guys, I think what I'm going to do is just go ahead and end today's episode off just here. So we've obviously had a baby, we've gotten pregnant again, we haven't had any birthdays, but that is okay, that is not to worry. So here's our little Venus making some candles, I hope you enjoy this angle. She's super cute. But yeah, so I know that today's episode was, I don't know, probably a little bit different than usual, but also I'm going to need some baby names that are related to space and start with the letter I. And then our next theme is going to be gemstones and crystals, so I'm so super super excited about that. I'm also really excited to play with the new pack, but obviously in my Let's Plays right now, that's kind of not really a thing that can happen. But regardless, if you guys are enjoying my content, I hope that you will consider subscribing if you haven't already. And while you're there, one, click that little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified every single time that I do upload a brand new video. And if you enjoyed today's video in particular, please be sure to go ahead and click the like button as that really does help me out. And let me know in the comments down below what you'd like to see on my channel next. Thank you all so very much very much for watching and until next time bye bye